Good afternoon. It is Saturday, July, nope, June 13th, 2020. Welcome to the Big Fat Channel. All right, what's up, Big Fat Nation? We are kicking ass and taking names. All right, what's going on, everybody? Uh, we have been busy today. We got a lot done. Uh, ran to Lowe's earlier this morning. Got a bunch of stuff uh, on the trailer. Had a little mishap with a flat tire while I was loading the trailer at Lowe's. So that was fun to uh, move 20, 40 pound bags of topsoil uh, into the Jeep instead of on the trailer. Um, other than that, we made a lot of progress with um, some of the trim out on the pool deck, as well as the edging for the side and backyard. And I will show you that right now. All right, so in between the pool and the, and the deck, we have this little area right here that I was able to finish the trim out today. I think it looks really great. I have a small little solar powered um, LED light down there for a little bit of light uh, once it gets dark out to illuminate this area. Gives it a nice little glow at night down here. It is motion activated, although um, it probably won't sense any motion um, unless you're walking down here, but it just gives it a nice little light um, once it gets dark out. All right, I think I showed you this last night. Uh, we're trying to clean up the side yard. This will probably be maybe next weekend's project. Um, I just got to put some um, angular bracing on these columns just to shore them up a little. That, that, that deck is rock solid. It's not going anywhere. Um, but we just want to make sure we're getting our left to right bracing set up. I'm probably going to build some type of hanger system for the ladder there and clean up all these wires. Um, got all the fascia trimmed out. There was a spot over there at the end um, that was missing, but we got all the fascia trimmed out. I just got to go through and replace all these screw heads with um, white um, painted um, screw heads. And then the big project for today was this back wall. I showed you these trees the other day, but we got all the holes dug all the liner in and the edging down, trying to get it as straight as possible. Don't know how uh, possible that's gonna be, um, but I got a bunch of topsoil I'm gonna spread out. We got some seed down that's starting to root. Um, we'll throw another couple, half, maybe a half bag down in this area, get the topsoil spread, and then this area should be good. Probably gonna build a little enclosure back here to hide the pool pump and everything under the deck. Going to build out a little um, enclosed system back here, probably for the um, all the chemicals and stuff. Move, the, move these paver blocks probably to, uh, I don't know where I'm going to use those, but um, everything's starting to look really good. And then we got the edging going up the side yard. Trying to keep that as straight as possible. I'm probably going to lay down this soil and seed tonight, and then we're just going to do mulch in the side. Going to go back and get another probably 10 or 12 um, of those little arborvitaes to line this area right here. And that should wrap up most of the backyard. I got a couple things I got to plant. Um, there and then we should be pretty good I actually want to do something here probably put a door or at least something to close this in um, and then we're pretty much wrapped up for the backyard actually no, that's not true over along that retaining wall over there we got to put in a short little three or four foot fence um, just to keep things from falling over the edge or keep the little ones from. Um... All right, just about to get the grill fired up. We have chicken thighs, not chicken breasts. So they cook a little differently than chicken breasts. Um, I actually am starting to like chicken thighs a little more than chicken breasts grilled. Chicken breasts tend to 
um, dry out a little bit, in my opinion. The, the thighs stay a little juicier, a little meatier. Um, so we've been doing those on the grill a lot lately. All right, so we've had the chicken um, marinating in some barbecue sauce for a little while now. We're gonna throw it on the grill. Always wanna be careful with chicken in your prep. Make sure you clean all your surfaces and make sure to uh, not cross contaminate. Uh, so anything you use to put the chicken on the grill, make sure you don't use that to um, flip and end up serving your food. Next. All right, we're throwing it on. My flowers up here, honey. Right here. I'll put it right next to it. Look. Okay. Thank you. Oh, oh shit. All right, so again, knowing where your hot spots are on your grill will help to know how your food is cooking. Um, I know personally that the backside of my grill cooks um, less hot or cooler than the front side of the grill. So I know the pieces that I put on the front, if I keep those, um, if I rotate to the, those to the back um, when I flip, I'll know that the front and back will end up cooking um, about evenly. So you just want to learn to know your grill, um, where your hot spots are, how it cooks, and you can really enjoy grilling. I personally love grilling. It's one of my favorite things. Uh, making chili, grilling um, are two of my favorite things. So uh, hopefully this summer we're going to bring you a lot of grilling videos, hopefully a couple techniques that I use um, that maybe you can use in, in your grilling or maybe try out a few things. We do also have a smoker that I'm going to try to fire up um, maybe towards the end of the summer, probably during football season. Um, so uh, we'll get these chicken thighs cooked, get them plated. We have some awesome macaroni salad that uh, Stace made up. Um, that I really love. It's got the um, hard-boiled eggs, got green peppers, mayo, salt, pepper, uh, typical macaroni salad. Um, I really enjoy it. Goes well with anything barbecue, in my opinion. Um, but these barbecue chicken thighs, uh, to me, it, it pairs perfectly. Um, so that'll probably do it for tonight. We're gonna wrap up, get this one edited, published, and then tomorrow we're gonna be back out um, working around the yard, try to put put together some footage to. Um, get out another video tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow night on Sunday, 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 fun day. All right. We'll see you. Have a good night. Have a good weekend. We will see you tomorrow. Wah!